2E0EOL. Time for another beer review. Another one from Independent Spirit. Ball and Chain. Now I had one of these that was um oh, I forget the title of it now, but it was oh, it was fantastic sort of um chili type beer. Um but not this time, so we haven't tried this one before, I don't think. Collaboration brew with sound brewery. Pals Palsbo, spelt Papa, Oscar, Uniform, Lima, Sierra, Bravo, Oscar, USA. Smoked double bock ish. Not quite ish, apparently. Strong beer. Uh, it's Netherlands. Okay. Collaboration brew, Netherlands, USA. www. Browergmolen.ln. Again, I'll post the link um, in the description. Echo Bravo Charlie figures seven niner. Um, I'm not sure what that means actually. I know about the International Bitterness Unit, I, I, IBU, um, but I don't know about EBC. Hmm. Not sure what that means. Ingredients: water. Barley malts, smoked hills, caramel, chocolate, roasted, bitter hops, Columbus, Saz, Sierra Alpha Alpha Zulu. Bottom fermenting yeast. Keep cool and dark. Now I don't think I can keep it, I can keep it cool, but I can't keep it dark. I assume that's shorthand for I'm keeping it in a dark place. Recommended drinking temperature. That's nice. Don't often see that. Seven degrees Celsius. Unpasteurized. Figures 7.1% ABV. There's a 33CL bottle. Okay. Um, nothing particularly interesting on the back. Right. Let's have a go at this one then. I've left this out of the fridge for about um, half an hour. Ooh, very smoked, very smoked uh, flavour to that. Ooh. Not particularly much um, sediment in that. Okay. Again, very, 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 very smoky. Um, just really perceive. Uh, I guess it would be smoked hops or something. Is that what it says? What have they smoked? Barley malts they've smoked. Not. Um, no mention of hops actually. Seems legit. Oh yeah, bitter hops, bitter hops and smoked malts. Okay. All right. Very very smooth. Starts to become more bitter as an aftertaste, but tastes quite sweet um, on first taste. Yeah, I think most people would say it's very sweet, sweet and very um, very smoked, and um, it is really nice actually, really nice. It's a great flavour. Um, wouldn't particularly describe it as hoppy at all. Um, it's interesting. There's nothing. There's no particular more depth to it than that.
you know, chocolatey, bittery malts, but and there is a smoked, smoked aftertaste, bit a slightly bitter, but on the whole, quite sweet. Yeah, is it something to write home about? Probably not, but that's because we <laughs> we're in abundance of great beer. Um, so many great beers available that. Uh, one second. <clears throat> so many great beers of, uh, available that um, it's only. You know, me. I wouldn't. I wouldn't use the word mediocre. It, it is a really nice beer. The average pub, unfortunately, we're still in in a world where the average pub found this as a real ale or craft beer fan. You'd be laughing. Absolutely brilliant. Although uh, in the wonderful world of craft beers available from shops, um, probably that imperial, um, um, the imperial barley wine I had last night, um, I'd probably choose that one over this. However, this is a very good effort. I have nothing bad to say about this at all. Um, okay, on to the next before I waffle on. Thanks for watching. To Echo Zero, Echo Oscar Lima. Enjoy the beer, lads.